Or I could use it as the pin of shame. Trust me, you do not want the pin of shame. Your phone will be blowing oh, up yeah. with If you, you know, Loki, no, if you get pinned to shame, Loki. I feel like I would just I'm probably coming. Nah, no, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. The pin of shame. Once Loki, though, if you get pinned to shame, then I feel like you should really, like, rethink your life. Loki. The comments. Yeah, this video is going to be rough. The comment section, yeah, it sucks ass. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's got its pros. Mm. I'm able to heart some of your comments on this heart video. Heart, pin and, them. Uh, can speak their opinions about how they feel about this video or whatever. But obviously, a public forum where you can literally type anything, that's going to come with a lot of cons. See, there's many phrases, many people, many things that I've seen in the comment section recently. I've seen a lot of videos talking about IG Reels comments specifically or how bad. Yeah, all right, yep. It's something like that too yeah. right. and i'm sure as i'm speaking right now there's probably a bunch of comments that say bro fell off and you know what bro i actually did fall off and that hurts my yeah but yeah low-key when i say um bro fell off kind of a little bit like lost his meeting now i'm like i'm even gonna lie because niggas just now be just commenting that like randomly and it's like you know sometimes sometimes you know oh bro actually fell off but sometimes like bro hasn't even fell off it's just he's not doing as great as he used to like low-key when i say you YouTube commenters, I feel like definitely just overuse certain shit. Same with TikTokers. Like, so they just feelings i'm just kidding like can it just be something different i'm sick of scrolling through the comment section and seeing that shit. like please leave any other comment besides that i see at least like, like be original actually the first hour of me dropping a video like i don't know why i'm seeing these like what is the goal like at this point you study my numbers more than me bro how do you know i had a flop video and it doesn't even matter even if the video is doing extremely well people are still gonna say this like it's just a like yeah people are just trying to be trolls but it's like let me just leave this shit behind wasn't it relevant what, like, what are you like, doing what are you doing ago? like no, you saw, could be doing COVID something COVID better did. but you want to comment you fell off somebody say to me 1k views in 10 minutes bro Sivius's career took a nosedive like i'd rather see that at this point like goddamn there is a shit ton of copy paste comment section phrases that they're just really like you annoying. fell off just put the prize in a bag sigma on this it's just like, like over and over again at this point i don't know if these dudes are speaking like they used to be funny but now people just like use the shit game character dialogue like you go up to one of the npcs in pokemon that's what it's spitting out another comment i've seen a lot on like queso's vods or just people who blew up on tiktok people who came from tiktok aren't allowed to like this comment wait isn't the goal to like, get likes okay, like, 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 do you not want likes like, or do you not want other people they leave a comment like, they just want likes or they want a creator to notice their comments but do you think if people keep typing the same shit over and over again youtubers will magically know notice their comment hell no they're just gonna scroll right by it because they've seen it too many times so they just don't care anymore i'll also see comments all the time on my videos that say like jesus loves you uh thank you i i guess i don't know where these okay that one i feel like it's mainly just people like you know like like uh, people who believe in like christ and all that just saying you know jesus lives loves you or some shit like that comments just started spawning in from i have no idea but you know what bro i'm glad that this commenter confirmed jesus does in fact love me thank you if you're not in a retirement home eating pudding you should know that youtubers can pin comments and a lot of times people will do the most to try to get the pin comment i really don't know why like, not, not gonna lie when i said at this point i just pin random people loki like, like if i don't have anything show, like, to like comment the then comments. i i just like pinning random people hand, even if they ask but i'm like man. comments that said blank chain like just insert anything comment gang chain the reason why it got out of hand is because those were the only comments 
comments I was pinning. So it, it was just not a good idea. So naturally that was being spammed in my comment section because every uh, thankfully I don't have to suffer like, you know from this because I'm just a reaction comment. channel. Like instead I should <laughs> pin a comment that I think is funny as hell or is relevant to the video or I could use it as the pin of shame. Trust me, you do not want the pin of shame. Your phone will be blowing oh, up yeah. reply. If you, you know, low key, if you get pinned to chain, low key. I feel like I would just I'm probably coming. Nah, I'm playing. I'm just playing. I'm gave playing. Him the pin of shame. Once low key, though, if you get pinned to shame, then I feel like you should really like rethink your life. Low key, <laughs> like you're just gonna now, get absolutely cooked, roasted. Video, like without talking about the people who are begging for likes. A lot of the comments that are begging. Like, for what are the likes are gonna do? Down arrow pointing to the like button. People who did nothing. I'm like Team Pisonette with the arrow. Pointing like I hate I really hate comments like this like nigga. I'm on team Kai you know what? I'm gonna what does that have to do with the video? And why do you want likes? Like, even like, specifically for likes, because you get nothing out of it. Like, yeah, you like if it's uncreative, then I understand we're wanting the likes. But if it's something like then what? What do you take? Someone spamming them? What the fuck? Look at me, guys! Ten thousand likes. But usually the people who try to get likes don't get them. People who aren't trying to get likes usually end up being the ones that get likes because they just make it so obvious that they only want likes. So people are just gonna scroll right by it. I don't know why I see this comment on every video, but it says one like equals one push up. Dog, you're not doing all those push ups. Like, oh yeah, oh yeah, hold up. One like e equals one push up. Um, okay, let's see. It gets a thousand push ups. Oh, um, hope you get built like, I don't know, Hugh Jackman and, you know, you know, grab, grab those damn muscles. Hope you get those damn muscles from g at least getting like, you know, like one million like likes. Like, how, how are those likes, you know, how are those likes doing for you? How, how are they doing for your push-ups? Physically snap in half before I get the 20,000 push-ups. <laughs> when those comments first started going on, around, it off. I would see them everywhere and they would have like thousands of likes. I can't believe they would lie to me like that. Why didn't they do the push-ups? Next time I see one of those comments, I'm asking somebody to take a video of themselves doing all those push-ups. Yeah, look at it too. Someone actually had done, done a video of that. Same. Like, it, it, someone actually did a video of them like doing every push-up to get a like. This in 2024. I don't know how every single time those comments end up at the top of the comment section how is it really that easy to get likes well i guess eh. on this video one like equals one dollar of my rent paid please like the video but when people see now we get these likes uh, let me the make sure i really like it now if mr Beast did it that I, I would be very different i don't know why i think maybe because it's the first time in their life they had some kind of approval from thousands of people you know obviously since they have a lot of new coming fans you know they have to thank them edit oh my god guys thank you for ten thousand likes i really appreciate it edit like, 20,000 mm. guys i'm so famous please like, listen little bro no one cares literally little bro I mean, literally no one know. gives a fuck why like literally yeah, 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 literally literally no one gives a fuck about you getting 10,000 likes literally like no one like look your friends might see it but guess what no one gives a fuck point in this because the people that like the only time someone will actually like really care is if it's like twitter and you you, you and get like a banger but that's about it if it's not make you it's not like tiktok so youtube or instagram no one's gonna, gonna give a fuck I don't consider myself famous by any means at all somebody who's famous is someone who's well known so if i just go up to somebody yo bro did you see edgelord 101 at the top of the comment section <laughs> edgelord 101 yeah bro i know who that guy is actually edgelord 101 he's on the map all right let me stop hating but this element of the comment section has been around since the dawn of time toxicity there are so many people in the comments yeah, okay yeah this, this i feel like this one's always gonna be like a youtube amazing. thing or like anything on social media like tech like, you know what? That's fine. Because sometimes people can't, it. like, respect other niggas' like, so opinions. Mad. So, like... They actually wish death on the person or just hate the person for no reason. You know what? Like, you yeah, 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 piss on his grave, like, yeah. Your father left you and your family doesn't like you. Like, damn, like, bro. Like, we well, didn't need to get that. Like, damn, all you really have to do is just say, I, I disagree with your opinion, like but, man. Behind the screen. Because like, they never actually get shit for it. Unless your face and your name are attached to the comment, then you're probably cooked. But if the person that said, Fortnite is good gets so mad at you they could probably use that information against you and drop your IP address. yeah cuz cuz niggas could also like hack nowadays cuz hacking nowadays is like very easy so you gotta make sure like you like watch out what you say cuz you know jump in somebody who will write a paragraph will jump in listen dude I'm not like, reading all that they'll talk about how Fortnite I'm, I'm at that one piece meme right here I'm not reading all that shit I'm not.
and why it does laps around every other game out there. But it took you 20 minutes to type that bit up. Why did you waste your time? Like that? I don't know. I don't see the vision. You could be doing paragraphs anything else. I don't know who but yeah, your bitch list type up dumbass wants to type nobody an entire paragraph that literally no one's gonna read. People even see your comment is slim to none. But these types of people live in the comment section. They will reply back in minutes. You'll already have a notification on your phone saying that they replied to you. But this is advice for a YouTuber, a commenter, whoever it is. Do not live in the comment section. It's just such a waste of time. Like, okay, yeah, sure, read and reply to comments, but like, there's no reason to be in comment sections 24 seven. Another thing that I notice is nobody takes anything serious. Like, even if it is something that's very serious, I don't know, somebody's grandmother tragically passed. Yeah, what? There will be people that reply and say, Hold we're up. smoking on that grandmother pack, rip bozo, <laughs> womp womp, cry. Like, nigga, like, nigga, why, why are you commenting this on someone that, like, it actually happened? Like, I can understand if it's like, I don't know, like a, it's like a skin video or something like that, or it's basically something, but it's like, no, there will be a video of someone saying, oh, my grandma died or something like that. So I said, oh yeah, we're smoking on that dead, his dead grandma's pack, yeah, rest in, rest in peace, piss on his grave about it like it's crazy they can't be serious for one second like they like, always got like be imagine that happened to one of your family really mates like they do it and not only can they not take it serious like they're just being dicks for no reason like does it really make you feel good about yourself that you say shit like that bro it's just really messed up in my opinion i don't know why the hell people go around and say this shit. like they will genuinely hate on you because a tragic event happened in your life wow but speaking of hate let's talk oh, so about we'll mob mentality mob mentality <laughs> mob mentality or or aka in karen in general mm. not just in comment sections but i do see it frequently in the comments and sometimes yeah it's deserved 100 percent like there's yeah. no way people are just letting edp slide and get away with it absolutely not but there's times where people will actually get hate for the dumbest reason and sometimes people will just blindly agree with it and start hating on them too like the fact that people actually got mad at kai over the whole fireworks thing is ridiculous like it was obviously for like, a clip or i, I see this one all the time people get mad at miss Mr. Beast for doing nice yeah, things. Yeah, these are like the two dumbest ones, right? Like the Kai one, whatever, right? It, like niggas are gonna be thinking, oh, it's actually real, and he actually blew up his what? His one million dollar like mansion because like, oh yeah, let me build, let me blow it up because guess what? The views is gonna basically you know repay for it or whatever. Then Mr. Beast now, Mr. Beast been getting a, a lot of recent like hate because like you know Chris and uh some like former employee. But it's like before that, niggas always just randomly hate a Mr. Mr. Beast because they because there's a, a lot of dumb shit Loki just a lot of dumb shit like I always feel bad for Mr. Beast and it's like wow good job random Twitter user you're changing lives like it's always what some Twitter say, user with like some type of female profile YouTuber having a Starbucks cup in the background of his video wow and it's not like anybody typing up these Twitter threads is doing shit for the environment and the crazy like, like, part like what are you doing like yeah you had a job but I don't honestly, what are you I don't doing know, just missing something or what but these people just have the worst takes imaginable and mr beast even put out a tweet throwing shots at these people as he should i wouldn't let my name get disrespected like that either i mean twitter's always been going after celebrities for the dumbest reason but it's just the biggest waste of time ever like like it's crazy that people have that much free time to go back five years ago look at something that you did and paint this narrative that you're like a terrible person but this next thing is a like if someone said really so, if a white person said like the n-word like like years ago i would probably understand it, but it's like they change. Thing, I feel like they, they wouldn't say it now. Usually, you'll see like some generic ass comment, like claim your one hour ticket, or like oh yeah, the spam, put into the spam comments like these or the hack ones. The way I can put it, like I once saw one that said, you know what, Wordy, you are a natural on the mic. I was like, huh, oh, thank you so much. Man. I really. <sighs> another bot and at this point i want to know am i actually a natural on the mic i need this question answered drop a comment or sometimes you'll see i like, feel like you are Marty loki i think you're actually a natural on the mic loki dude was literally pretending to be me in the comment section he had my what? profile picture and oh yeah one of these to follow him on telegram what is the purpose of these bots is it like to hack you when you get the like link? some of these bots are literally just to hack you or so, so something like that spam telegram that was pretending to be me and i tried 
trolled him for about a day back and forth. And then I just stopped messaging him because he was trying to get information out of me. He was telling me he was going to ship me a PS5. Because he was telling me to provide my shipping address, my credit card number, the three little digits on the back, and my country of residence. And you know what I did? I gave him all my information. I got the PS5. Look at how cool. I was say, what I'm I'm with him and I just wasted his time for an entire day. He was probably fuming when I realized I was just trolling him. But these bot comments need to be studied seriously. I don't know why you. Yeah, Loki. I don't understand. Like, this YouTube you security like is not that good. You like, like my video on content farms? Just click it. Says that was the video. We guys did a video. Yeah, okay, yo, Loki. I agree with literally all of these. Like Loki, especially that last one because it was like, it, for some reason, bot comments on YouTube just never stop. Like you can literally block one bot, then for some fucking reason, more start like comp like more start like appearing it's mainly because youtube security is, is just suck like they don't do a lot of mo like moderating it's like you know mainly a bot and then they have like a few human like you know reviewers but it's mainly they mainly do it because of bots because like you know it's faster but it's like uh they really need to do more human reviews for comment bots because this just so as that was the video hope you guys enjoyed the video please subscribe to the bell and if i win i upload a new video comment what do you guys want to react to next so as that was the video i'll see you guys later bye Oops.